watching Leo Wolf, Leo Wolf TV. The face paint I have been doing for years and I can definitely say I do not promote the uh, use of the Halloween makeup kits that you buy from Dollar General or Party City. I'm sure they work just fine for some people but I just don't care for them. I don't like having to uh, put ointment on my face or some sort of uh, oil on my face first or after to get the paint off because it's really got it's really on there. <laughs> If you use folk art paint to paint on your face, now let me just say this right out the gate. If you have, if you start to, if, if you paint your face and you start to itch, you may or may not have a reaction to it. It could just be the heat heating up the paint on your face and your face doesn't have any room to breathe so it's causing it to dry up and make it itchy. So, but I would still say be careful when doing it work with caution if your skin is if you're prone to breaking out I don't recommend putting it on your face now moving on to if you can put this on your if you can do this without it messing up your face I recommend it because once it dries now if you really take it on that can that can have some negative side effects because it will start to dry up and crack and crumb off over time you'll still have it on there but uh if you have facial hair, definitely paint around it because uh, it will solidify in your mustache. I mean, you can easily get it out because here's how you get it off. You can scratch it off because when it's dry, it'll just crumb off like I said. Now, if you uh, don't want to do that, you can go and you can wash it out. It comes right out. It comes right off the skin. With warm water, it becomes like a liquid. It becomes more of a paste of a rubber-based kind of almost like a latex and you can just peel it right off now if you really cake it on your eyelids it will stain your eyelids let me point that out now if you just put on a thin layer you should be just fine but if you put on like numerous layers like if you put like on one layer oh I need to add some more it's not quite thick enough you put that on there and you leave it for a while and then you go to like you know wipe it off your eyes will be a little stained it'll look like you have mascara on or eyeliner so just little food for thought yeah, food for thought there so I hope you all enjoyed this little tip here on face paint and getting creative with you know just painting on your body this could work on your arms your face anything like that and it could work on multi surfaces and like I pointed out here it comes off very easily so with all that being said I hope you all enjoyed this stay creative farewell wherever you fare and may God bless and I'll see you all next time on The Leo Wolf Show. Thank you. Devotees, the video you have just seen came from The Leo Wolf Show on EliteEntertainmentTV.com's platform. Now, that was unused episodes because there was a bit of a miscommunication as to like what the theme should be. And overall, we decided to go in a different direction as far as which theme. However, I enjoyed this particular video and thought that I should have repurpose it and it should be seen. So... It says The Leo Wolf Show, but I'm airing it on Leo Wolf TV. Now, I understand that's a little confusing, but let me just give you a quick rundown. Leo Wolf TV is on YouTube. The Leo Wolf Show is on EliteEntertainmentTV.com.
which is the agency that I am currently with. So just wanted to get that out the way. There won't be a many videos like this, it's just a few. Farewell wherever y'all fare. May God bless and thanks for watching.